welcome back to another video. So for this video, I'll be doing my um, BTS albums collections. Yes, um, and this will be uh, BTS editions because I figured out that if I do like all the albums together in one video, it's gonna be too long. And second of all, my camera cannot hold such a long video because I don't have much memory left in my phone. So yeah, so I'm just gonna do BTS uh, album collection first, and then I would do like probably the other group later on. In another video, if that makes sense at all. So yeah, let's start with their Korean discography first. And then here's the Tuko First School, their first um, singles. And some of you are asking me, how do I store my albums? And this is exactly what I did. I put them in a plastic sleeve um, to protect them from getting dirty and dust. Because I hate dust the most than any like anything on the shelf. Yeah, so yeah, this is a great idea, guys. And... This is their Oh You Late first meeting. Um, school Lot of Fared. Normal editions. Unfortunately, I don't have the special because it was ridiculously expensive. And I'm not planning on getting. So here is Dark and Wild. First full length. It was not even focused. Okay. And here I just have a signed copy for it. This is a promo sign. Then we have The Most Beautiful Moment in Life, Part 1. Focus, please. Uh, both versions. I got the white and pink. All right here. And then here we have the part two, blue version and peach version. And then here we have their kind of like a special albums of their like the most beautiful moment in life series. All combined here. And then, which is one of my favorite, by the way. Yes. Yeah. Um, and I also had like a sign, copy, promote sign as well. And here's the black, or I mean, the night version. And here's the wings. I got all four versions. I'm sorry for any background noise if y'all hear anything. <laughs> and then here is the uh, repackaged You Never Walk Along, both versions. Uh, and then we have their Lecture So Heard. I got all four versions, of course. And I still have an extra set, which I'm trying to sell because I'm trying to make space for my album. So if anybody will want to help me out, please, please do let me know. And then let's move on to their Japanese stuff. So here we have their box set for My Draw DNA Crystal Snow. And then here we, I'm just going to go and I don't have every version or I don't actually have like most of their Japanese stuff. But yeah, here is uh, Wake Up, the normal edition. I recently got this. And then we have Black Swan Terror. I only have two versions. I have the normal, and then I also have the Type C with the photo book. And here's one of their run, um, well, um, Japanese, um, album, but I got the kind of like LP size. It is not an LP, it's just like, it's a normal CD inside, but they just make it look like an LP site, which I think it's really cool. That's why I got this edition. And then here I have their youth special editions. I don't bought the normal, so. And then we have their latest release, Face Herself, Normal Editions. Uh, here's Type uh, C with the uh, CD and photo book. And here is Type um, B with CD and DVD. And I have there the best of uh, BTS. This is the Japanese editions. Oh, really pretty. And here's the Korean edition, which is my favorite. My absolutely favorite one. They look like prints here. They look so damn good. And then now let's move on to DVD. So here I had their epilogue on stage down 16. I really love this. It's so pretty. We have their The Winged Tord. I'm not going in order, by the way. Um, Blu-ray versions. I just pick up what I saw. <laughs> and then here is their the DVD. I mean, yeah, the DVD versions. Or, yeah. And we have their third mustard. I'm sorry, I'm kind of like rushing through. <laughs> but yeah, that's that. And then we have their memory systems, uh, 15. Really small compared to their 2016, by the way. Which is right here. It was really big, which I love. And then let's go to their now, el uh, man, now photo book, I mean. So I have now two, which I'm missing now one, but I'm not planning on getting it. Unless I find it for a good price, like, otherwise. Like, the reason why I even have this is because I, like, you, I cannot believe how I, like, 
I mean, this is probably the cheapest price I ever found. You know? So, that's why I got it. I'm really happy about this purchase. And then, here we have now three in Chicago. Absolutely one of my favorite, too. Love, love, love. It's so pretty. Okay, and then we have their um, summer package, which is really pretty. Uh... They, look, they just look so good. And what's make this even better is... Ta-da! <laughs> I got Tay selfie photo book, which I absolutely love it. And we have their um, season greeting to that 18. Really cute. I love the style, like, yeah, of just everything. Last but not least, we have this gigantic photo book. Which I absolutely love it. Yes, this is probably one of my favorite things BTS ever released. It is so pretty. And they have HD photo in here, guys. And that include everything in my BTS collections. Yes, I'm missing quite a lot. But like I said, I don't feel the need to buy every version for their Japanese. Like the older one, I mean. Because like if they're releasing like their new album, I will pro I will definitely purchase every versions well not every version but because for example like the face yourself i don't have the a versions which is fine um at least i have like three versions but yeah um but for their older albums uh like japanese albums i'm not planning on getting them um but yeah this is all my bts albums that i own um so i hope you guys enjoy and be on the lookout for my other album collections video yeah for the rest of the group that I ever own. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoy. I know this is really messy. It is the, my first time ever filmed like a um, album collection. So yeah, but I do hope you guys enjoy. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! Hey guys, so I also want to show you guys how they will look like on my shelf. So yeah, I'm just going to do a quick overview. So right here is the first tier. Here is the second tier. Here's the third tier. Fourth tier. And here's the last tier. So, as you can tell, I kind of put them by color, coordinated, and also by height. So, I'm kind of put, like, tallest to shortest. So, same thing for the last tier down here. And, except this tier right here, which, um, the height are basically almost the same, which I like. And then, these two show are kind of in the same situation, where they're just tallest to shortest. Yeah, and but then, the first tier right here contain only my BTS albums, as you can tell. And, you know, I can't really afford to decorate or put them however I would, I would want them to be. Because, it is more important that they're together, so... Yeah, that's just my priority, um, putting them all in one shelf. And, of course, I'm trying, but then the first shelf does not fit these right here, because um, this part is also BTS, and then this is BAP, and then these two albums are the other group. And then we also have some more BTS albums down here. A few of them, and then the rest are, again, just my other group. They are kind of scattered everywhere, because I don't have enough space to kind of put on them on their own, and I just don't like... Like, I actually try to put them on, like, their own group, but then I don't like how it looks on the shelf, if that makes sense. Like, the aesthetics just, I just don't like it. So, that's why this is how I end up putting them. Um, but yeah, um, and up there, I just kind of have, like, box for storage. I have official goods in here, uh, unofficial goods, and then these are just, uh, washi tape and stickers, stationery stuff. And then here I have more albums for, I mean, not for, <laughs> because they don't, I don't have enough space down here, so they had to be up here. So yeah, this is basically, um, everything that were on the shelf. I hope you guys enjoy, and yeah. Bye!